Hey guys, this is Aaron from Geeky Lemon Development and in this tutorial I will be showing you how to create a random word generator. So if we go straight away into Xcode and File, New Project, make sure it's a view based application for the iPhone and I'll name this Random Word. Oh. Random Word. And save that. It's for it to load up now. Make it bigger so we can all see. And straight into our classes file into the view controller.h. We've seen we've got our IB outlets and IB actions. So we'll start with the IB um, outlets button, sorry. So IB outlet space UI label space little star and text view. And we go down to our action button and we type in dash bracket IB action bracket call this random. Okay so that's all it's needed for them there so we simply save that and go into our view controller dot m and we're going to want to start by putting the action button so bracket IB action and we named it random space and then curly bracket enter then int text space equal sign space rand bracket bracket space percentage sign and I'm going to have five outcomes in this random word generator so I simply put the number five and that with a semicolon and enter switch now in this first oh do that again sorry now in the first highlighted section here we type in text and just after case we put the number zero and in statement we type in text view dot text space equal sign space at symbol quotation mark and our first random word I'll just simply do colours so I'll type in blue quotation mark and that with a semicolon and now if you just simply want to copy from this first break upwards to case and then we press enter paste that there and change this zero to a number one and then change the blue to a different colour or word so green and that makes our second random word so if you simply want to do that for however many random words you have and I'll just simply change all the colours so that can be red that can be yellow and that one can be pink and I want to change all the cases so just keep going up so that's two three and four now because we simply have five random words this is the um, number we put here five so if you want to add a six one then you simply, um, simply type in num well, the number six so we zoom out there and at the end of the code in here you simply want to put enter and then curly bracket so then the code should look like this so now we want to go into, well simply save that and then go into our resources into our view controller dot nib now all we're going to do now is put our label in and our button in so every time we press the button a random word is generated into the label so it just, it just appears okay here we go then so first th well first things first we're going to want to find our there we go our label just place that there and our round rec button let's 
place them there like that. Then if we go into our files owner, and we simply drag the text view to the label, and the random to the um, button, and touch up inside, and save that and quit. And make sure this is in the simulator, and we can go build and run, and that should work perfectly fine. There should be no um, errors or anything like that. Just wait for this to load up. Okay, here we go. iPhone simulator. Okay, here we go then. So then every time we press the button, one of our ran well, one of my random colours should appear in the label. So that red, pink, yellow, yellow again, blue, red, pink, yellow, yellow, pink, blue, and so on and so on. Now this can be useful if you're doing something like passwords and you're trying to um, generate random letters or if you're just having a little bit of fun like a memory game and you just want to place some random words in and you just want to make your application a bit more fun it comes in really handy so that's it for today and make sure you check out all my other tutorials and make sure you subscribe and thumbs up the video and also comment or message me if there's any tutorials you want to request but for now, my um, link for Facebook and Twitter are in the description. I also have a few apps on the App Store at the moment, so if you want to go check them out. But for now, the usual guys, um, comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next tutorial.